All right, guys. So hey, this seventy Wildcat uh, rear light. She looks kind of bad, guys. But I'm gonna use this Blue Magic polish, and uh, I'm gonna see how this thing polish out, guys. I mean, when I share these videos, sometime like on Facebook, you know, guys be like, "Oh, you advertise, you advertise." I'm not getting paid nothing from Blue Magic. I just like showing guys like stuff uh, good for your car, like the car jacket, stuff like that. I just like, you know, hey, helping people get their cars together and preserving them, guys. So, no, Blue Magic, I mean, if they ever watch this video and they, you know, want to send me a check, that's fine. But it's just a polish that you use with your hand. And it works pretty good. I got a video showing me do an emblem on my 77. And it polished out pretty pretty doggone good on there. But I'm on, uh, you know, I'm not going to sit back and do the video of me polishing this. You know, I don't know, you know, is that boring or what. So I'm going to just come back after I get this polished out and just show you the difference in it. And right now, I can wipe on this. Let me get a towel. Actually, put put a little uh, juice on this. And see, it's it's still it looks a little better, but it's still dulling up, guys. It's still like real, real dull. So I'm gonna show you what this blue magic does. You know, I mean. That's not gonna that's not gonna really come off of there guys. But wait wait when I get done with this blue magic and I'll show you this. And and I got both of them on this 70 Wildcat convertible. One of them is cracked, I think either right here or right here got a hole in it, and the other one is cracked over in this corner. So the the bezel, the light bezel that goes over here is pretty thick, guys. So I'm going to cut whatever section out is bad here. And uh, I'm going to plastic weld. I'm going to plastic weld that in, guys. And that light bezel is going to hide that. I mean, because I think finding one of these is going to be almost impossible. And then if somebody got one, they're going to want mega money for it. So I got two different tail lights. Both of them are cracked in two different places I'm on cut a section out guys because I think the other one is good in this area and I'm gonna weld in from the back side plastic where this light bezel covers this section up here and covers this section up here and I'm on weld that in and you're not gonna be able to tell guys all right guys so if you can see right in there is the only place I didn't polish this 70 tail light lens with that blue magic. So see if I come by or if you see where I didn't do it at. But everywhere else has been done guys. So um I'll do this last little bit. I just wanted to show you the difference on how those tail light lenses come out guys I even polished in there real good if you see certain corners I didn't get the best I'm still going there and get that a little better I didn't have I like the like put tape on a screwdriver small screwdriver head where the head won't scratch and then use the paper towel dip it in the blue magic and then I can use a small uh, screwdriver to get in there and get those corners guys so you know i'll watch a bucks game one day and you know i spend most of the night in between uh Giannis getting fouled and uh you know i'll be uh hitting those corners guys all right all right guys so hopefully you see the difference there i got that tail light all polished out it's really looking good guys so stay tuned I'm I got a video coming up uh, the left side 
one has got a crack right in here the other one is cracked over here so the one that's cracked over here guys I'm gonna take it and make two out of one man I've seen some of these priced as high as uh, seven hundred dollars a pair uh, somebody had a set for a hundred dollars and uh, <clears throat> I just I don't know I'm gonna just repair the one I got guys I'm gonna show you how to do it it's gonna work out fine uh, the only reason is because the bezel that goes over the top of this they're real thick so I'm gonna be able to patch it in behind the bezel and you'll never be able to know but anyway guys I'm gonna show you how to do that but man that thing polished out good with that blue magic polish uh, really good you can hand you know this is hand hand buffing guys this is not using no kind of buffer on this this is just uh, let me show you here real quick I just dip it in the polish and you just wipe you know might go in different directions then you take a dry piece of towel and wipe it down guys it's no this is all hand buffing down here guys so hey you like these videos guys like share subscribe thanks for tuning in hit the bell button where uh you know when i'm dropping a video and guys if you can let the ads play let the ads play i've noticed they be putting some pretty long ones on mine but uh you know while in between your Put the video when the when the long ad come on. Just go get a cup of coffee, guys, and you know make you a cup of coffee, and come on back and finish watching the video. You know, but uh, if you can watch the videos, I mean watch watch the ads, guys, and uh, it helps me out. That way, I might be able to travel to a town or state near you. So you know. All things on the road, guys, is what I want to do. All things Buick on the road. Come where you at. All right. Watch those, uh, watch those ads, guys. All right.